Good morning everyone. How are you all? Welcome to your robotics class. Today we start scratch programming. Let's just watch the video and comment. Good morning students. How are you all? So just open your scratch website or scratch app in your system or software. Okay. We discuss and we learn how to make the shark hunt game. Okay, shark catcher game or shark hunt game. Just go to the backdrops. Go to underwater and click on underwater. Check the, click on the sprite and type shark. This shark too. Okay. And another sprite is fish. This is fish. So, first we do the block coding of fish and then we do the shark. Okay. First, just click on the fish and start recording. Go to events when green flag click. Just one by one follow my steps okay otherwise you draw you will wrong the animation go to motion go to random position go to control take forever loop motion move three steps turn One degree again, move three steps and if on edge, bounce. Here is complete. Now, next block go to events when green flag click, go to control, take forever loop. And fix if then loop into the forever loop. Go to sensing. Touching. Sharp. Go to sound. Start sound. Here we can choose the sound. There is no sound of coins. Okay. So first we go to the sounds. Just click on the sound. And search here coin click it go to code again and click the drop down menu and just click on coin fine good go to variables first make a variable scores okay just change score my variable could delete and Click on the scores. Go to motion. Turn 180 degrees. Go to control. Wait 0 0.5 seconds. Now next block in fish. Okay. Don't change the sprite. Green flag C. You do the coding on the fish, not the shark. Okay. First, you complete the fish coding. When green flag clicked, go to control, take forever loop, and take if then loop inside the forever loop. Go to operators. Here is the sign of lesser than or greater than. Okay. We need the greater than sign. Go to sensing, distance to shark. Okay. Here we write the number 60. Go to motion. Turn 180 degrees. Move 30 steps. Okay, so here we complete the coding of fish. 
See, three blocks are here. Okay. So we just complete the coding of fish. Now click on the shark. We do the coding of shark now. Go to events. When green flag clicked. Go to variables. Set scores to zero. Go to motion. Go to X minus seven seventy three X's and minus sixty nine. Go to events. Just drop down menu and open the up arrow. Control. Repeat ten times. Change y by two. Just duplicate down arrow. Repeat ten times. Change y by minus two. Again, we need duplicate left arrow. Go to looks, switch costume. Just put switch costume block between the when left arrow or repeat. Okay. Just go to the costumes now and see. We need this costume here. Okay. We need this costume here. So this is shark to be. Just click on the drop down menu. And shark to be okay, and we change the block from y axis to x axis. Here we use x axis minus two. Again, we need duplicate of this, and here is right. Okay, up, down, left, right. Nice. And here is the positive two. This is the coding. Okay. I hope you have no any problem. So here is the fish coding. Okay. And here is the shark coding. We just need to screen break and press on the green flag. When the score increase, you will hear the sound of score increase. And you just use the keys of up, down, left, right on the keyboard. See, when the fish automatically close to the shark, score will automatically increase, and we hear the voice. Okay, that's the game. Okay, fine. So I hope you have no any doubt. If you have any queries. Please ask me in my in the classroom when you come in the school okay thank you